Hello, I'm going to show you how to crochet this beautiful snowflake. For this uh, project, I'm using a double knit yarn and a 4mm crochet hook, but you can use a different type if you want to. And we start with making a slip knot, and we are going to chain six. One, two, three, four, five, six. We are now working back into your very first chain you made. And we're going to make a slip stitch into that chain. So just pull yarn all the way through. We have made a circle and next round all the stitches will be worked into that circle. We'll start off with chain four, which will count as a double crochet plus chain one. And now make double crochet into that circle. We'll make a double crochet first. And then we're going to make chain one and this is what we will be repeating now for this round we will repeat um, 11 double crochets and 11 chain one stitches in total we will end up with 12 posts all the way around so let's keep going until we have made 12 posts Let's just count them to make sure we have 12 all the way around. Yep, and then we are now closing this circle, going working back into that first chain you made. Next round, we're going to slip stitch into the first chain one space. And now we're making points for your snowflake. First, we're going to chain five. And then working back into the third chain from the hook, we are going to make a slip stitch. And then chain two again. And go into the next chain one space and make a slip stitch into that space. And that's a little point made for your snowflake. Now we're going to work on a larger one. Chain four. Going back into the third chain from your hook make a slip stitch chain four again and again going back into the third chain from your hook make a slip stitch now chain three going back into the third chain make a slip stitch chain three again and going into the third chain from your hook again to make a slip stitch and then finally we're going to chain four again going back into the third stitch and make a slip stitch and to finish off we're going to chain one and now we're going to attach that to the next chain one space with a slip stitch just make sure you don't twist that um, spike what you just made by accident that's your next point made for your snowflake I'm going to repeat these two now all the way around so chain five first, go back into the third chain, slip stitch, chain two, and attach it to the next space with a slip stitch, chain four, slip stitch into the third chain from your hook, chain four again. And slip stitch into the third chain from your hook chain three and slip stitch into third chain from your hook chain three slip stitch into third chain from the hook and then chain four and slip stitch into third chain from your hook and now you just have to chain one and attach it into the next chain one space and you have made two longer spikes and two shorter ones and this is what we will be repeating all the way around so chain five for the little one and go into the third chain from your hook chain two 
and slip stitch into the next space and then making a big one again we go into chain four slip stitch into the third chain from your hook chain four again going again into the third chain from your hook chain three go into third chain chain three again into the third chain and then chain four and slip stitch into the third chain from your hook chain one and attach it to the next space and then again into the little one and then another large one all the way around until you get to the end when you made your final peak for your snowflake just attach it into the next chain one space with a slip stitch and you can now fasten off and cut your yarn you have uh, two little ends that you need to sew in and hide um, stretch out all the um, primary spikes of your snowflake just to shape it a little bit better and flatten it if you want you can also starch it if you wish or you can just get a card and glue it onto the card this is the glue i use but if you have your favorite craft glue please use that one thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoy making lots of snowflakes